Welcome to Madison HD Sportsnet presented by the JMU Alumni Association. I'm here with head volleyball coach Lauren Steinbrecher. Good morning. Lauren, thanks for joining us. It was a tough weekend for the Dukes, dropping to UNCW and College of Charleston in the first conference losses of the season, but they were the good teams. Talk a little bit about this weekend. Yeah, obviously a tough weekend for us um, with our first two losses in, in quite a while. Um, but they were against really good teams, and I thought that both those teams uh, just did a great job um, creating a scouting report, executing it, and just playing at a high level. Um, obviously, I did not feel <laughs> the same way about our team. Um, and we just we just didn't play well, to be honest. And, you know, every team um, has bad days and off days, and we certainly had an off weekend. Um, I thought that we were high air offensively, which we haven't been all year. Um, I felt like our pursuit and effort could have been a lot better. Um, and then just being able to focus on playing, I thought there just seemed to be everything else going on in the world um, that we couldn't just get him to focus in on, on playing. But um, I thought Taylor Austin had a good weekend defensively. I thought she uh, played hard, got a lot of great ups, and, and did a good job leading us. And um, you always learn more from losses than winning, and so I'm excited to, um, you know, take responsibility for the areas that we did not execute and figure out a way to, to change that around. Um, and, you know, much rather happen now than in the CAA tournament, so I think we, we learned a lot this weekend, and uh, we're ready to make those changes. And you guys have three big matches left in the regular season mm -hmm. facing Northeastern, Hofstra, and Towson. Are the goals still the same heading into these last three games? Absolutely. You know, our season goal has been to win a conference championship, and obviously nothing, nothing's going to change with that. And then just focusing on every point, and um, we have to play against every opponent to win uh, in our conference, and so that will obviously start Thursday with Northeastern. Then all three of these matches are on the road. Is it a little bit of different preparation seeing that you were home for the last five games? Yes, it'll be different, and I think uh, in a good way. You know, I think that there's just a, you know, it's been an eventful two weeks here at JMU with senior weekend, and the weekend before was obviously a lot going on campus. And so it will be nice to get away and just focus on each other and the team and, um, and executing each point. And I think that will be great for us. I'm excited um, to actually hit the road with this group and, and have the opportunity to play again on Thursday. And then the Dukes are still number one in the CAA with a 11-2 and two record. What is the mentality looking like heading into the conference championships? Yeah, you know, I think that the hard work that we have put forth, you know, even since January has put us in a position to be first. And we had a bad weekend, and everybody has bad weekends. Um, but we're just looking to focus on what we can do today. And we don't need to look at the past, and we don't need to look, obviously, at the tournament since that's three matches away. But what can we do today to be our best so that we can be our best on Thursday? And then when Thursday comes, it's just every point. What can we do to be our best? What can we do to be our best? That point, and nothing else matters. And when we try to think about everything, past, present, future, uh, it's too much to handle. And we really have to get better at just focusing on each point and each moment and how we can be our best right then. Well, Lauren, thank you so much for joining us, and good luck this weekend. Thanks.